It's round six, Cedar City Works Vlog. Here we go. Uh, the wind and the dust decided to show up for this one, so that's why we got the goggles on. But we're at Three Peaks Oasis, and there's a water slide back there, a full pool, all the platforms, the whole deal. So uh, it's gonna be a party, so here we go. Work Vlog. My brain is not awake yet. Okay, let's try this again. All right, good morning. It is Saturday, it's race day, and we're getting ready. We've got Hinkley. Hinkley, talk to the people. What's up, people? <laughs> um, Hinkley's my com compatriot here for this race. He's the only one that came down to, to do Cedar City. Um, but yeah, we're just getting ready to uh, do some unclassified practice here in a bit. Got breakfast in already. Um, only got a little bit cold last night, but the wind is somewhat tame right now and it's probably only going to get worse. So we're going to see how uh, that turns out. But fortunately, I kind of rode the course on my mountain bike last night and it's very similar to how it was last year. So hopefully that'll give me a little bit of a, a leg up because I know where to go for the most part. So um, yeah, we'll uh, get this party started here pretty soon. Let's do it. Tree. We got the voice of works here. Like this is guy. He's the first thing you hear in the morning if you come to a race. He's the last thing you hear at night. We've got Chris. He's there now. It's right. Works. Hey. Chris, good afternoon, everybody. What's the word today? Did you bring the W word? Man, I did not bring it. We had we had to battle this last week, and you know Thursday and Friday we were setting up for the side by sides and the quads. It was so hectic, so windy. There's areas I couldn't even see ten feet in front of me from the desk. Honest to God, I was pulling rocks out of my eyes Wednesday and Thursday of this week from last weekend. That's how gnarly yeah. it was. But yeah. hey, yesterday, the W word didn't pop up that much. We had a little bit, but we probably had 200 people here at the pond. They're oh, launching yeah. off the big jump. Yeah, yeah. They're launching off of here. And I'm putting a challenge to all of our pros, Pro 250s, and Pro Ams motorcycles tomorrow. If they make podium, they need to do the water slide. They, they gotta send the slide. I like it. Yeah, Chris has got the best spot up here in the house. We're up on top of the the jump platform, and uh, yeah, you got the whole pond and the, the slide and everything in the background. But it's yeah. pretty cool that they got that access to us for everyone. This is a here. really unique venue. The last year they had to pay extra to be able to use the pond. This year, Randy Perry from Works made a, made a deal with the owner here at Three Peaks Oasis. So if you come in through the gate, you have full access to the whole facility. Yeah. They got a zip line that goes to a pond. They got a bicycle ramp that goes under the lake. They got a bicycle ramp that goes over, clears the tabletop on the other side. Right. Um, the, I think it's 26 feet. Jump off, jump off the jump tower. They oh, got a rope swing over there. The real question is, what do we got to do to get you to jump off that? End now, of the day, real hot. You think? Tomorrow afternoon after the pro race, I might join the guys doing the slide. Okay, okay. that's All my right. plan. So, heck yeah. Well, thanks, yeah. Chris. This well, is a this is a special treat. You'll see him around the works uh, pits all the time during the weekends. But uh, yeah, he's he's. He's all over the place. So what's the deal here? What do we got it's going on? Him. Are you the lifeguard? No, he is. He is a lifeguard. <laughs> they, they both are. They both are. So what's the rules here? Uh, hot women only. Hot women only. Yeah. So uh, where where are they? Nowhere. Uh, uh, we're looking for them. They got lost. Well, that, there's, one, there's one on the trampoline. They got lost. Uh, one over there. All right, let's see your best throwing star. All right, go. Oh man, oh man. But maybe maybe uh, that's why we don't have hot women around. So you gotta get up your throwing stars. Yeah, maybe I need to practice a little more.
Well, it's almost race time, so uh, gearing up, gonna get hop onto this puppy. And the wind is pretty gnarly. It's picked up a bunch. There's a lot of dust, but it's drying out the track really fast. So it'll be interesting to see how it is. The unclassified fact is just after on the second lap, it was already starting to get really choppy. And so I'm imagining there's one race we're going on right now, and then we're the second race. It's probably gonna be rough. So I'll uh, just uh, throw on the GoPro and. Um, Give her a send. Cedar City. Woo.
Yeah, it's kind of rough. Yeah. Hold it down. I can only imagine. I'll yeah. you guys. Hey, is this another recording? How was the race? Oh boy. It was good. I survived. Yeah? Yeah, I survived. How'd you finish? Sixth place. Nice. Sixth place. Had a good battle with Jason. Me and him were sixth and seventh. Changed position several times. Had a good time. Jumped all the jumps, survived. So that's it. This is Mo. This is Josh. He, yeah, I'm Josh. Um, these guys are a stand-up guy. Last night we were hanging out. They gave me food. They bought me a nine-volt battery so my microphone would actually work. Yeah. So yeah, if you're ever in the pits, come check out Mo. They they do a ride around here, and you're at like every race too. Every so. race. Three years I've been racing every works race. So yeah, he's got the he's got the sweet setup. He does open sea in the first race. Does that as a warm up, and then he sends it for uh, 50C. 50, the prestigious 50C class, we yeah, like to call it. Yeah. Yeah. I'll be in B next year. Everybody, calm down. <laughs> oh, here we go. Ended up nine. What do you have to say about that? It's better than I did. Okay, well, just checked out the results. I got nine. Um. I think it's not terrible considering that I completely botched the start and stalled. So that was kind of a bummer. But um, I don't know. I rode pretty well. I tightened up pretty good in the middle. My hands and arms got real tired. Uh, but I kind of salvaged it, I guess. So we're just going to hang out. Maybe go play in the pool a little bit. So thanks for following along. And uh, we'll see you in, uh, I think it's Cache Valley next. So, let's go!